Okay, Lynn, today we're gonna go over how to get the new Lumion Elephage. To start with, we need to go to the arcade in Atlantic City and buy the huge plushie for 5,000 tickets from the arcade store. Once you've bought it, we can actually go talk to the little guild next to the store that will trade us a lost coin for the huge plushie. Then we can take this lost coin and trade it to someone else. To find this person, leave the arcade and head to the living district by taking the most left tunnel. Once you're in the living district, head up the closest staircase and talk to this NPC who is looking for his lost coin. And for finding it, he will give you the arcade key. Taking this back to the arcade, we now have access to the door in the back of the room. And inside of this room is some cool machines that are from Brick Bronze, an out of order disc drop arcade machine, and a business log that goes in depth of why this specific disc drop arcade machine is out of order. But we can actually interact with this machine, which will let us play disc drop, although it isn't quite the same disc drop minigame we're used to. The game gets very glitchy very fast, but it is still playable, and every 10,000 score you get on this machine, a new type of green disc will appear. You want to match three of these, so you need to get at the minimum a score of 30,000 to have three of them appear. If you game over, you can play the game again, or if you activate an ace disc or a bar blast bomb that removes these special green discs, you just have to get another 10,000 score for another one to spawn in. Once you are free on the board, you just gotta go and line them up with each other, which is very easy because unlike the normal rules of the discs, these special ones are free to move wherever you want. Once you line up all three, the arcade game will blue screen and will give you an error output. You can now quit out of the game and Elephage will now be encounterable. Also to note, this is a soft resettable Lumion, meaning you can run away from it, catch it, KO it, or even lose to it. You can restart the battle like any other softly settable, meaning you can go for the specific one that you want, like the alpha or secret ability one. Although, not the gamma, because you have to do the mastery first, which does require you to catch one, which also you can't do without catching this one. But once you're happy with the Elephage you got, you can say that you're happy with the results, and Elephage will now be encounterable in the wild as a roamer. Although, to my knowledge, Elephage isn't meant to be a legendary roamer, like Dusk or Mutagon, it's kind of similar to the mastery roamers, Vary and Prayermind, who are kind of like normal Lumians, but fairly unique. And that's it, that's how you get Elephage. Hopefully this video helps, if it does, make sure to hit that like button, and if you aren't already subscribed, why not? It would really help me out. But other than that low, I'll see you guys next time.